Am I eating this right? Because I want to go bulking. Day one, Sajopaga versus Light Let's go! Goodness gracious! It's been almost months since Home United played a game. Now we're back as Lion City Sailors. Quite debatable why they changed the name, but whatever. At least we're back in action. Now we're waiting for some of the people supposed to be warden here so I'm really really pumped for it. I really need to check the lineup. See how it goes. You know? Honestly looking at the lineup I'm pretty confident we could get the win but you could never underestimate Tanjung Paga because they sound really decent. Huh? No no that's not mine. This is mine. This is mine. Yeah. But yeah I'm pretty confident we can win but never underestimate never underestimate Jaguars you no. Know? They haven't been playing since 2014. Oh hello <laughs> Yeah I do you too Hold on, okay. So my prediction, Lion City Sailors, we're going for the win, maybe 4-3. It's going to be goals. There's going to be goals. But I don't know, because they look, both sides look strong. So you could never know the odds. You could never know the odds. Eddie, predictions? Um, Let's go. Really looking forward to this, man. Hey, don't gonna lie. Looking at this audience, we are back. We are actually sort of packed. Just wish the inside was so full. Yeah. Gosh, I'm excited. Uh, prediction. What's the score? What do you think? 2-0 or 2-1? 2 nail, 2 one okay. So, some of them, uh, two of them predicted 2-0 or 2-1. I'm going 4-3. Eddie is going 4-0. Because that's going to be goal. Oh my, there's two more going in. Bro, prediction. Uh, 3-0 3 nil. Well, I mean, we're going more than two goals though <laughs> I wanna be I wanna be A Lion City Sailors Lion City Sailors Just like the others Just like the others Vision Stadium So echo And the sailors are the best around. Echo, Kick echo, off! So echo and echo out. Our sailors are the best in town. Our sailors are the best in town. Let's go, sailors! Let's go! Let's go, sailors! Let's go! Let's go. Let's go. Louder! Let's go. Our sailors are the best all around. So echo, echo out loud. So echo, echo out loud. Our sailors are the best in town. Our sailors are the best in town. Let's go, sailors! Let's go, sailors! Let's go! Let's go. Uh, your name is Hold. Yeah. Right. What's your name? Junie. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put that on my list later. Her name? Emil. That's a girl's name. No. Mouth? Okay, anyway. Okay, anyway. Uh, what do you guys think of the game right now? Um, it's, it's going fairly slow. There's no like big opportunities except for that one. Yeah. But it was a goal. Yeah. Fair enough. There's been a yellow card. And it's on counter! Hopefully they can score a goal Yeah, we have to, we have to keep track. Oh! Oh! Yellow! 
guy, another free kick. I can't believe it. The ref is so annoying. He doesn't do anything. <laughs> okay, wait. Okay. Uh, other than Lion City Sailors, what club do you support? Chelsea. Um, Chelsea in the Premier League. Chelsea. Yeah. Um, I, I'm more to the United. Yeah, I'm Man United. Daniel James is good. Oh, you like Daniel James? I like um, oh Mason Greenwood's my favorite. Oh, Mason Greenwood. Oh, Mason Greenwood. Okay. Yeah. You should train hard and be like him, but more to the Lion City Sailors. Right? Okay, promise me that. Promise me in how old are you again? Promise me in at least eight years time. Yeah, yeah. Promise me in eight years time you will play for Net Lion City Sailors. I'll try. I'll try. Okay. Free kick. Free kick. Okay. Let's go. Free kick. Oh, come on. Oh. <laughs> Penalties. Let's go! I told you there's gonna be goals! Bro, I think you should go America, go acting lah, brother. Uh, and the Oscar goes to that guy. Clap your hands. No, I clap your hands because no one gives a damn. Yay! Ah, uh, battle of the season.
for the airline event. Be so share with all your friends and let them know that the lead is ongoing and uh, ask them to visit all the various stadiums so they can support the team's election. Touch! We deserve to win this game, but hey, it's a fun football indeed. It's great to be back. Hopefully, we will see more in the next game again. Stephanie's Rovers at the Stephanie's Hub. It's gonna be a long trip indeed. But hey, I meant we're enjoying the moment. How about not? But yeah, um, really happy to have them here. Shout out to Andy for that wonderful debut goal. I think he's being interviewed there right now. He's been a very wonderful player. Really deserve two goals, maybe three goals actually. Oh my! Oh, do, uh, what do you think of his debut goal? Oh, it was good, nice. but he, so he slipped, I think, with yeah, that second yeah, one. Yeah. He's yeah. absolutely yeah. beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, thank you, thank you for, uh, thank you for coming oh, here and support you. your son. We we yeah, come. I mean, actually, we, we won't be able to come, unfortunately. No, no, no. Okay, 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 okay. Go get him. Apa kita tak kalah kan? Nasi tak kalah. How do you pronounce how do you pronounce his name? Pengeli. Oh Pengeli. Oh. Yeah, we get all these different names. Oh yeah. Alright guys, I'm here with Jerome, the unofficial SG podcast. I would say I would just call it SG Football Podcast because yeah. you're the legit you're the realest thing in YouTube right now, other than SG SG. So uh could you share to me how you're feeling of the return, the new season? Um, it feels great. Uh, the new season, of course, a lot, of, a lot of new things coming up. We do have the Lion City Sailors. We do have Tajo Baga United as well coming back. So it's definitely something that I'm really looking forward to. Um, and of course, all the rest of my crew as well. We're looking forward so very much to the new season as well. Yeah. Hopefully, they can come down. For I, think they, I think they miss you. Oh, <laughs> they really miss you. I hope. I think the thing is, we have been a little bit out of it for a while. I mean, I mean, fella Aaron has been going through. Has been doing a lot of work, so he's been very busy. Oh, no worries, no worries. But, uh, it's good he's to still, have you back. He still does so much of the stuff behind the scenes as well and he really helps people like me, help people like my photographers and everybody else get a platform to share more about local football and to really bring it forward because it deserves to be brought forward. Let's talk about the the elephant in the room. Yeah. Warriors FC. Mm. It's a very shocking it's a very shocking announcement indeed. Yeah. I was hoping it would be ten teams but then yeah. it will still remain nine. How do you feel? I mean as a Trashukang boy it's quite sad. It really is very sad, but I mean, they have their own internal problems, which I mean, I don't want to delve too much into. But it's a good thing that some of their players are actually going to all the different clubs. Like you have a few coming here, yeah. Um, and a few like going for instance, to Andy Pengeli right there. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So you do have different players going on to different teams as well, and hopefully they do well, you know. Yeah. Um, and hopefully Warriors, you know, they they like how Tanjung Paka have, you know, find their feet and then come back into the league again because we really do need a league of more teams as well, you know, yeah, to get the excitement factor going Get back, get back all the foreigners. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Um, but it, it, it was good to see tonight. Tonight was very refreshing to yeah. see 2,000 over people in the stadium. Yeah, speaking of the atmosphere, yeah. it is very lively compared to two to three years ago. Yes, very much so. Because like I started coming back to the local football in 2016, um, and it's because of people like you know Gelang Ultras, the Fools, um, the Jack Force as well, people like Eddie and people like passionate people from the podcast as well. They really showed me how much local football, how much there is to local football, and how much you know there is to support in local football, and it's been fantastic. So I'm assuming you're neutral. You're yes. just gonna enjoy SG football. Yeah. Okay. My last question. Sure. Who do you think is going to win? Wow, season? it's I, a very it's a very tough because if you look, if we watch back, wow. Haogong is very strong. Yeah, Tampines, they I think they lost the game against Brunei. Mm. So two games played, they lost. Brunei won their first game. Yeah, very scared. They still at, <laughs> at, <laughs> at, at Brunei. They're still in Brunei. Yeah, who do you think? Who do you think? I mean, it could go anywhere. Yeah, it, it honestly could go either way. I still predict the top three of not not in any order, but I still predict the top three of Haogong. Um, DPMM will definitely be in the running as Obviously, well as yeah. as well as Tampines. I yeah. think these three will will be up there. Albrex is in option. Albrex, I, I don't think, think they so. will be. They might break into that part. But it's good to see them bring in a number of local players. Right. I think that's that's a fact. Like six of their local six local players in their team now. 
Um, hopefully they are able to, you know, really be given the opportunity. Players like Gareth Lowe, uh, Zamani Zamri, all of them. Um, so hopefully we see more of them. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Uh, I know I'm a little bit burdened of doing this, but thank it's you right. so much for being part it's of the all videos. Good. It's all good. Really hoping to get uh, the MSG SG also involved. Uh, Will you be Will you be coming to the international games? There is one coming. Yeah, definitely. I'll, I'll be going to as many games as I as I possibly can. Setting the standards like the Arsenal fan TV. Oh, <laughs> no hopefully, la, okay. hopefully. I think the main thing is to make sure that we get uh, we get the voices and opinions of the local fans. Ah, so yes. I think. Um, voices are very important. Yeah, because I mean, Arsenal fan TV gets a very bad flag. Um, <laughs> yeah, they get really. Thing, but I think yeah. it's it's a good thing that they're doing giving fans a voice. Yeah, and I think maybe they should give a lot of different fans yeah. a voice. And as I well. think we sh- and I think we should do our own also, but then not to negative part you know, at least. Yeah, and at least that's what you're doing, and that at least what I see some people are doing. So yeah, it's really grateful to have you back. Uh, oh, do ch- do check the SG podcast in the description. I'll put their video also. I got tagged in, but I'm not don't want to brag on it, but. It's really an honor to have him, and yeah, thank you, thank you no, so it's much. No, it's an honor to have you guys watching the game as well and speaking to us. We really want to make sure that we yeah. bring up local football. Yeah, we hope to see you again. Uh. Definitely. Yeah, that, that is it, Jerome from SG Podcast. Do follow them on their Instagram, their Facebook, and also their YouTube channel.